South Africa, welcome to the Sound City MVP Awards. We are here live at the Echo Hotel and Suites, and I'm here with your favorite VJs from Sound City. I have Moea Bebe and VJ Adam. That's right. As well as myself, Elma Godwin, and we are going to be your red carpet hosts for tonight. I am wearing Ray Adams. What are you wearing? Uh, well, I'm rocking Mark Jacobs tonight, and I'm super excited to be here. As you know, we're live in over 43 countries around Africa. I'm talking over 200 million viewers. The hashtag online is the hashtag Sound City MVP 2016, and my way is a fashion expert tonight. Thank you very much, VJ Adams. Yes, and like VJ Adams said, big, big welcome to the most anticipated and the biggest award show taking place here in Africa. My name is Moe, or better yet known as your screen and radio goddess, and my job here on the red carpet is to keep you in the know of everything concerning fashion. The do's, the don'ts, the what to, the what not to wear at this award show that has been created to award some of the big players in the industry. Of course, Moe, I know you got this, but yes, we're going to leave you here on the red carpet. Absolutely, kill of it, course. break a leg. <laughs> Thank you. Good luck in the fashion, Moe. I need the good luck. All right, now the stakes are extremely high tonight with 14 categories. I am so excited. The performance lineup is absolutely packed with some of the most successful and influential musicians. It is going to be a spectacular evening. So yes, the MVP awards pretty much starts now. Don't forget to join on the conversation. Hashtag Sound City MVP 2016 on all forms of social media. I do know that VJ Adams and Elma will definitely have you covered in any moment it now so do sit tight keep on watching sound city tv because we are here to make you know exactly what an award show is pretty much all about i am so excited so yes i am in fact heading on over to see or catch up with adams and elma <laughs> from the red carpet here at the Sound City MVP Awards 2016. Joining us is the adorable Niniola Absolute Phenomena tonight. How are you? I'm fine, thank you. How are you? I'm super excited to be here tonight. And I guess you are absolutely phenomenal. 2016 has been a great year for you. What is 2017 looking like? Greatness, more greatness, um, more blessings for me and for you. Let's talk about the Sound City MVP Awards tonight, the categories. Of course, um, you're a major part of this. How exciting is it for you? Um, I just feel very blessed because um, I started two years ago and um, for me it's big. You know, to be nominated, it's a big achievement for me. The recognition is awesome and I'm very thankful and I hope to win. And if I don't, then, you know, I keep working harder. And even if I do, I keep working harder. I'll never stop, you know, my OAS. Apart from you winning your category, who else do you think just might win? Um, everyone um, is a potential winner, so that's what I'll say. Let's, yes. As you're being a politician right now. No, 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 no. <laughs> what are you wearing tonight? Uh, what are you wearing tonight? Um, I don't know. My stylist just got it for me. I didn't even ask him. Good evening, Noble. It's so good to see you. Fine, thank you. So good to see you too. Thank you. You're looking really, really dashing as usual. Thank you very much. All right, so what would you say is the best thing to wear to an award show like this? Um, it depends. Um, I mean, it's the MVP, so you want to come looking like an MVP. Uh, and for me, um, I'm wearing Lulu, shoes by Lulu, uh, belts by Lulu, uh, jacket by robes, uh, my pants are by my attire for my shirt by kimono. So I'm kind of wearing like about four different Nigerian designers and that's how you should dress. <laughs> yeah, I agree, I agree, I agree. All right, so what do you think about the fashion industry, most especially here in Nigeria? Um, I love the fashion industry. Um, I have to look at myself as one of the players in the fashion industry. And I'm happy to be alive when Nigerians are proud to wear Nigerian. Like, you know, so these days people don't go like, oh, where's the suit from? People go like, is it my attire for? Is it this person? Is it this person? And for the ladies, Landreda Silva, Diola Sego, um, Maki O, everybody is proudly wearing Made in Nigeria and, and it's a good time for us and it's also helping the economy. So yeah, there's a job for the tailors, there's a job for the designers 
and there's jobs for everybody who's in the fashion industry by the grace of God. Thank you. I decided to keep it, you know, a little bit masculine today. <laughs> All right, well, thank you so much. Yes, guys, still remain tuned here at Sound City because it's time for the Sound City MVP Awards. I'm, in fact, heading on over to VJ Adams, who is, in fact, ready and obviously here to give you a very informative interview with Humble Smith, I believe. Did you like saying no, 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 be saying I'm saying my brother. Oh, yeah, Joe, for me, I do care for a long. Everyone, it's okay. Welcome back to Live from the Red Carpet here at the South City MVP Awards 2016. Joining me right now is Humbo Smith. Good to see you, brother. Yes, bros, I'm good. Rehearsals today was absolutely great. Are you nervous to perform tonight? Man, I mean, I'm not nervous, man. I'm just, I just need to go there and do my thing, you know. Why well, I know how to do best, that's all. Tell me about this song. How, what has changed since this song became very popular? Oh, it's not cheap. Absolutely. The remix with David O. Um, I think um, it's been by God's grace, you know. God has been showing me much love on the song. You know, actually, I wrote the song in the church. Do you understand? And after writing the song, I told God, this song is not just for me. It's for me and you. So we need to make the song a hit. So God been doing his work, you know, that's it. So and I have so much love for my fans, man. God bless them. Final thoughts tonight, your nomination. Um, I was nominated for Viewer's Choice. Yeah, and I'm, I'm hoping towards that. Maybe by God's will, I'll go on with our word, you know. <laughs> Wish you good luck tonight. Good to see you. Moe is on standby with someone she's about to chat with, though. And, of course, Moe, as you know, she's uh, the fashion expert tonight. She's going to be telling us everything about the fashion, who's looking hot, who's not looking hot, all of that great stuff. Remember, follow the conversation online with the hashtag SoundCityMVP2016. Follow us online. That is what this. That's the hashtag. To track all the videos, all the pictures. We'll have deal to the two and hosting the early part of the show alongside Basket Mouth. Humble Smith performing at the Blaze of Glory alongside Niniola, YC, but just to mention a few. We'll promise you the best coverage yet. Over 20 cameras bringing you all the razzmatazz, the glitz, the glamour, the paparazzi. All here live for you at the Sound City MVP Awards 2016. Always on standby. Thank you very much, Adams. Oh, wow. I am standing next to Ramsey Noah, the very, very handsome and dashing actor. How are you? I'm very well. Thank you yourself. You look great. Don't, don't need to tell me anymore. Oh, thank you so much. Thank you. So why did you not opt for a blazer with this full look? Um, it's music word. We always like to do it like casual and, you know, play around with all the crazy styles and all of that. So hence this. Hmm? So do you, well, if you were to go back in time, let's say, and you were to give advice to your younger self, fashion advice, what would it be? It's going to be a tough one because at the time they had the fashion. For instance, we had the bell bottoms and we had all of that. And then it came in handy at the time. Yeah. Fashion-wise, it's going to be hard to say that I can I can tweak it and say, okay, I wish it was now than then. But it all depends. It's about time, you know, time frame. So I don't think I have anything to say about when I go back to time and when it's now. It, it, it evolves with time. I'm just imagining if I was wearing something like this, like back in the time, you're going to be totally odd. Futuristic. Exactly. Yeah. yeah, well, I think I've seen a few right now dressing futuristic and they truly are odd. <laughs> All right, well, thank you so much. Hope you have a fantastic evening. I know you will, because it is. It sounds the MVPs, right? Yes, I know, right? It's good to be here. I mean, all the times you hear these guys and the music and all, it's now you're now witnessing and being with them one-on-one, -on -one, so that's a, that's a big thing. Now. I'm looking forward to taking some pictures with some of those <laughs> musicians that I know, those singers that I get to know. I love them. I love that. Today, I'm going to tell them how much I love their songs. Wow, awesome, awesome, awesome. Well, thank you so much for gracing us with your presence here on the red carpet. Thank you. All right, guys, it's still the Sounds MVP Awards, and I'm still here live on the red carpet. Tonight's lineup, especially when it comes to performances, is absolutely breathtaking. We've got Coca, we've got Alami Day, we've got Lil Cash, and so many outstanding artists are obviously up as nominees. It's going to be a spectacular evening. Don't forget to join in on the conversation. Hashtag Sounds MVP 2016 on all forms of social media. I'm here as your fashion expert, and yes, guys, don't even consider touching that dial. Yeah.